Hello, hello, my lovely people. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, Coco Bianco. Oh, Coco Bianco. Hey, Giove, me woro mumae. Oh, me woro mumae. Giove, me woro mumae. Ndi raba wala no. Giove, oh, me nene give mae. Oh, me nene in mae. Giove, me woro mumae. Ima nandi raba wala. Giove, wonye ne me man. Nana Giova Nandu Gigi of a home, a warm my Imandira Bawalano. My dear, you can't. You know. Did you guys hear the news? Eh, hey, whoa, my God, my Lord. Do you do that? Shame on the judiciary of Nigeria. Shame on the tsunami or tsunami or whatever his name is. I know where they are now, eh? They are hiding their faces under the, under the, under. They are covering their faces. They are covering their faces and they should cover their faces and they should take their gowns and those things that they used to cover their head and burn it to ashes. They should just toss them. They should just put them all in trash. Guess what I heard today? <laughs> after I made the Bolatinubu, after I made the Bolatinubu certificate was released, guess what I heard? You don't even want to hear what I had. Because all this time, they've been doing everything so that Atiku will not bring the evidence to court. Uh, but that one did not work. Atiku stood up and made sure that this thing will show up in court. The, thanks to the judges in America. America, eh? America, no matter what you tell America, hmm? when it comes to this judiciary thing, they make sure everybody have their own part to play. Okay? If it's the judiciary, this is our job and we're going to do our job and none of you will tell us how to do our job. It does not matter who you are. It does not matter how much you want to bribe us. And if you try to bribe them, they will bring you out in the open for all to see. Look at what is happening to, to former president of this country, Trump. As the president of this country, look at what is happening to him. He's in court of, with over 90 something charges that was put on him that he is going to court every day. Yesterday he was in court. Mm -hmm. Look at what is happening to all of them here in America. Would this happen in when people are doing good? Eh? When people are doing good, we need to give them kudos. We need to give them credit. In this country, no matter who you are, when you go to court eh, for anything, you will get that judge to say the right thing you don't have to worry i know a judge let me tell you i know a judge in nigeria i know i'm trying to go somewhere i'm trying to tell you guys some i don't a judge in nigeria hmm? that his gift her no her gift start coming from three uh, no one a.m if she has case if she has your case in the court her, the cartons of money will start coming from one a.m so she goes to sleep very, 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 very early, like about 7 o'clock, so that she can wake up about 12 in the night and start collecting her money. So in the, ne in the next day, the next day, she will do what she has to do. Now, now on a problem, all this money, house everywhere money. That's why when you go to any politician or any judges in Nigeria, when you catch them, when you go to their homes, eh, they have billions of Naira in their homes because the people that are doing the case is bringing the money in bucket for them in their homes mm -hmm. and when you have that person that is collecting money from from the back do you think he will get justice no but let me not go away from this thing that i'm trying to tell you now that is it, sweet in my brain they say the supreme court of nigeria the ones that are being selected to come and do this uh, Judi uh, judiciary supreme court thing for um i made the bola tinubu that the two of this did they say two or three of them refuse they even some of them are declining hey whoa. they decline said i don't want no come and be the person that will come here and judge this case no we no hey, hey. we don't want we don't want to be a part of it, I beg. Make on a carry go. So these people, they would rather resign than say the right thing. This is the country of a doom. Judiciaries, the, the, the judges in Nigeria are resigning. 
they are resigning instead of stepping up and putting our country to the right place they are resigning if you have not heard it i beg it's all over on social media all they are doing is just carrying a carrying a uh, this rubbish thing that they have in their heads all they are doing is just cover their face all they are doing they think wearing all these things is what makes them good judge look at the judge that that judge for article look at that beautiful woman how how sexy how elegant that she is wearing her gown and her robe she didn't have to cover her head to show that she is a judge but to see these ones that are covering their head they are covering the shame that they are put on themselves because they can't even re they can't even remove themselves and be the justice that they are supposed to be it started from when Ari Warder had to had to um, had to as a judge as a judge you know he has to uh, how did he do it get in a wheelchair he has to be on a wheelchair so that he can he can um, fool Nigerians that he was sick and um Elisha will record them mm -hmm. caught them while he was on a wheelchair they followed them to the airport from airport to where he went and where he went happened to be where um, Ahmed Obolatinubu is so he can go and meet Ahmed Obolatinubu when he got to the hotel he crawled inside the hotel and they are still waiting for him they delivered food in front of him in front of uh, the hotel the hotel he came out and picked up this food they are watching these people don't know that when they are um in a public they are working for the public that their life is like a mirror their life is like a mirror and a lot of people are paying attention to them so judges of nigeria supreme court judges would rather resign than say i ought to put their foot down and do what they're supposed to do they are resigning that's what I had. It's all over on social media. So you cannot hide it. They said that we would rather resign than stay here and say the right thing. We would rather resign than stay here and say that I made a Tunubu is a fraud. We would rather resign than, than look at the constitution and put it right what, what a, a tsunami and co has done. We would rather resign than speak up and then in the other video they i saw somebody that is uh, calling a uh, um uh, showing say showing where have you been all this thing that you are keeping silent i say no 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 so i said to myself i said no the person uh has missed the the stuff that the showing has said showing has not kept quiet showing instead of keeping um nigerians straight you see this election time brought a lot of things out the people that you respect now you know that they are a piece of rubbish so Shoyinka is busy chasing chasing a uh, obi he started from vice president of obi he started from vice president of obi when the man came out he said if you guys did this you will be doing this hmm? It started because of that video that he left. Shoyin Kai came out and attacked the guy. Mm -hmm. It's not enough. It started again after a, a judiciary put up this and that the man could not come out and say, Judiciary, you guys were wrong. About the FCT, you guys were wrong. About the gender, you guys were wrong about this you guys were wrong about all these things that you guys have said you were wrong but mm -mm, it did not say that it did not come out to say that he came out to tell obi that you did not win the election but now that the certificate is out and it's okay and it's open that everybody even a blind person can see that Ahmed Bolatinubu did not go to school Ahmed Bolatinubu is parading so they say Shoyinka where are you Shoyinka will not come out to, to say anything Shoyinka Shoyinka is busy still blaming Obi in his room Shoyinka will go down to the grave with evil thing that he has done because of this thing now that is happening a lot of them 
it's only one man one yoruba man one yoruba elderly man that have challenged mm -hmm. ahmed obola tenobo say if you say you have certificate please show it to us as far as that we know that he came out some time ago and said this is where he went to school we went over there with it's all over on social media it, we went over there we checked it and there was nothing like that that man god will bless that man you see when great men is not people that have money mm -mm. it's that's not great men great men is great men are people that see the truth and say the truth and call a spade a spade. That's the people that I call great men. The great men that belongs to my father's uh, group. My father will tell you, even if that cup that you're using to feed him, he will tell you to break it. I would say the truth. That's how my father is. This great man, the Yoruba man, a very good Nigerian, that have Nigerian at heart, said, I made a bola if you show me your certificate, hmm, I will put any money you guys want us to put down. But Nigerian elite is threatening. If it this, this will happen. So now judges are resigning. Judges are re refusing to take cases because they want one man to sit on top of us. Josie said, because why wouldn't they resign? If it's me too, I will resign. If it's me, I will resign. I should I will resign in shame. I will resign in shame that I am part of the thing that is causing problem in Nigeria. I will resign in shame for not coming out to speak up and said that what the judiciary did in this election was wrong. I will resign. I will resign because of what is going on in Nigeria and I am not able to help. You see the judge, this is a young judge. Maldonado is a young judge. See how she put it in a <coughs> in a simple English. Do you know before this thing happened, before this all these things happened, when he when he when uh made a Tinubu then brought the case. He wanted to see how they ruled it in Nigeria. And they were doing her ton ton. They were doing her rubbish, rubbish ton ton. They were not able to send her that thing. They want to, they want to f fool around with the woman. Until somebody in their camp too stole it. Stole it from where they put, wherever she, whoever it is, got it from. And send it to the judge. And the judgment, uh, read everything and saw how Nigerian judiciary fooled themselves, made themselves look stupid. Man. Now, instead of them to do the right thing, they are resigning. They are saying, we will not take this case. So, which case are you going to take? If you're not going to take a case that will put our country the right way. Which case are you going to take? Why can't you stay in the right? You see this uh, Madonado and Gilbert. They are in the book of Nigeria. They are up there. They are up there. Guess what? Nobody will come after them. No matter who you are. Nobody will come after them in this country because they have done what Nigerian judiciary, what Nigerian court, what Nigerian um, judges was not able to do. This single man and the woman did it without even wasting time. And after they did it, Ahmed Obola Tinobu was going back and forth, was going back and forth to go to, after the woman said, if you try to go and put, go to court again because of this, it will be denied. It will be denied. And he went to three more after reading that thing that was put in simple English for Dick and Harry to read. They went to three more and they were denied. They made full of Nigerians right here in America. And America has seen the true color. And all of you are saying, why didn't uh, uh, the president of this country, this great country called America, Biden, meet with Ahmed Bolatinubu? You think um, Biden is a stupid person like you guys? Biden has a lot going for him. He will bring himself so down. You think all these things that's happening, he doesn't know. He know. He had the news. He know. He know the people to 
go to and shake hands and the people not to shake hands with it. The man didn't even give them excuse of whether he would take a, a, this a, interview or not. He just left. He left uh, and left Amedo Bolatinubo right there and said to hell with this man. It's not a... Tomorrow now, the elite in Nigeria will put him in the plane, in Nigerian plane, instead of coming out and shouting that he should resign. They will not tell him to resign. The thing that they will do is to tell this man to stay that no matter what, the judiciary will save him. Now, the judiciary, they have started re resigning. They have started declining the case because they don't know how to say the truth even if it's right in front of them. They will not know how to say the truth. The money they are eating, these people will go to hell. And the type of cursing Nigerians have caused them, eh? God is listening to those curses. And when they get to heaven, if they will see the room to the to the road to the heaven, the road the, the door will be shut in front of them because of what they have done in this world that we are in. So, my lovely people, this video is to let you know. That Nigerian court, Nigerian Supreme Court, the judges, they are declining the case of Ahmed Bolatinubu. They are declining. They say, uh uh, we don't want to, I beg, we don't want to, we don't want to be a part of it. Mm -mm. I beg, take us out of it. So I just saw it. Let's say, let me come and tell you. You know, I'm here for all of you. I'm here when I hear you here, when I see you see. That's what I'm here for. I'm not here to fool around. I'm not here to fool around. Some Somebody put on my channel said, uh, Jane, your channel is not doing good because you, you can't find your niche. I beg, what is a niche? Niche, what? On your, where is niche from? <laughs> you can't find your niche. What do you mean by that? What do you mean go and find your niche? Now, now my niche is talking about what I'm talking right now. That's my own niche. I don't know. I cannot fake. I don't know how to fake to go and start looking for foolish things. I, I don't know where, where, what, where are you going to go and look for foolish things to talk about so that foolish people can come to your channel. If you bring people who are naked, now naked people will show up in your channel and start talking rubbish. So I want to say what is happening in the government of Nigeria. I want to let people know to be in alert when they go to Nigeria because Nigeria Anything can happen in Nigeria and they will tell you we will do it and there's nothing you can do about it. So if the judge that have a, all the power in his courtroom hmm, can come and tell you that he's resigning or he's not going to take a particular case because they, they, they don't want to judge right. You know the country is in problem. You know, they, do they want American judges to come and judge in Nigeria for them? They have told them. The writing, you know, the way the woman wrote the thing self in, in, in his uh, writing, eh? He really told the Nigerian judiciary that you guys are stupid. He said, there's no way you guys will see all this and you will not judge the right way. Judge the right way and put the devil to shame. He made all, she made all of you look stupid. She, she threw all of you in the toilet and flushed it by writing it in the simplest english so all of us can understand it and understand exactly what you guys did and he have yes another one now that have our everything she probably have not heard of our country but now you guys have carried everything that you are and give it to her hand it's now in her record every time you guys try to do she will be watching she will be watching to see the, the Mumu judiciary, judiciary Supreme Court that will pick up this story. And when they pick it up, let's see how far that they will go. We are watching. So, uh, I'm, 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 in short, I'm happy. I'm very, very happy that this is coming out. I don't have a high hope of what judiciary can do. If it's in a, in the same country, the Ahmed Balatinobu will resign, period, right now, like now, resign now. It should be a breaking news in Nigeria, breaking, 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 Ahmed Balatinobu has resigned, period. Nothing, but not in Nigeria, because that's a criminality country. That's a crime scene country. Nigeria is a crime scene, and until somebody figured out how to make this place stop bleeding, 
nothing good will come out there mm, from me to you thank you so much for watching bye bye